President Ferdinand Bongbong Marcos Jr. has ordered the pursuit of smugglers and hoarders of sugar in the country amid complaints of high prices of the commodity, Malakanang said on Thursday. In a press conference, Press Secretary Rose Beatrix Trixie Cruz Angeles confirmed that another inspection was conducted in a warehouse in Bulacan following the raid in Pampanga earlier in the day. Cruz Angeles said the Bureau of Customs, BAC, is expected to visit more warehouses suspected of hiding smuggled sugar. This is a series of raids. Yes Po we can confirm that there is another warehouse in the vicinity of Bulacan, the Copapoma confirm Kazi Diaco Shore Kung Tapos Na Yung Pag Inspect NG Bak, I cannot confirm because I'm not sure if the inspection is already finished. But we can confirm that there is another one today and possibly more in the coming days, she told reporters. Earlier today, Thousands of sacks of suspected smuggled sugar from Thailand were discovered in a warehouse in San Fernando City, Pampanga. Aside from those found inside the Lyson building in Brangay del Pilar, San Fernando City, there were also hundreds of sacks already loaded in delivery vans. They also found several imported items, including sacks of cornstarch from China, sacks of flour, plastic products, oil in plastic barrels motorcycle parts and wheels of different brands, helmets, LED television sets and paints. The palace said the inspection was made on orders from Executive Secretary Victor Rodriguez, acting on a directive from the president, for the buck to exercise its visitorial powers to all customs bonded warehouse and to check on the inventory of imported agricultural products with the aim of finding out if there is hoarding of sugar. The box Pampanga sugar warehouse raid may very well serve as a warning to unscrupulous traders who are currently hoarding their stocks of sugar in order to profit from the current artificial sugar shortage situation, Rodriguez said. The Bureau of Customs, BAC, raided two warehouses in Bulacan owned by a Chinese-Filipino sugar trader as part of the government's campaign against suspected sugar hoarders, Malakanang said Thursday. Acting on orders from Executive Secretary Victor Rodriguez, the Customs Intelligence and Investigation Service, CIS, headed by Officer in Charge Joe Frey Dasho and the Box Enforcement and Security Service, ESS, raided a warehouse along Capian Road, Brangay Capian in San Jose del Monte, Bulacan. During the raid, they found an estimated 25,000 to 30,000 sacks of different kinds of sugar which were neatly stacked in the warehouse owned by Victor Kua, who claimed that his sugar stock was locally purchased. Another warehouse owned by Kua in San Jose del Monte, Bulacan was also visited by the BAC and the Department of Agriculture Thursday afternoon. The floor area of the Kua-owned warehouse was between 2,000 and 3,000 square meters with an estimated 42,733 sacks of sugar which is roughly equivalent to 2,150 metric tons worth P215 million, according to estimates of the BAC. The joint BAC DA raid was based on information that the warehouse owned by Kua has been storing hoarded sugar aimed at tracking huge profits from the current high sugar prices in the market, the palace said. Earlier on Thursday, thousands of sacks of suspected smuggled sugar from Thailand were also discovered in a warehouse in San Fernando City, Pampanga.